cash. You know what it is. Uh, uh. Cash, cash. Woo! Cash, cash. Right, right. Little cash flow. Let's get it. Trick or treat. You know we trick or treat. We got beef switching throughout the season. It's the ghost of Bash TV news. Hello and welcome to Bash TV News for Friday, January 26th, Day 3. I'm Kaylee Reinboff. And I'm Lexi Jampietro. Please rise for the pledge of the flag, followed by a moment of silence. The Accent Bash's Creative Writing Club is looking for submissions to this year's magazine. Poetry, short stories, drama, creative nonfiction, music, or artwork can be submitted by today to bashaccent at boyertown.org. At Tuesday's boys basketball game versus Norristown, some of our students will conduct a Miracle Minute campaign to collect contributions for Preston's Pantry, the food bank that serves the Boyertown community. Please consider fighting food insecurity by, in our community by donating to this cause when the students canvass the stands. Any amount will help. Thanks in advance for being awesome. And now let's go live to Gabby Palumbo with some information about an upcoming fundraiser. Bash's new Leukemia and Lymphoma Club is having a fundraiser at Chipotle next Friday, February 2nd, from 4 to 8 p.m. To participate, bring a picture of this flyer, which is scrolling on the hallway TVs during the day. 33% of the sales will go to the LLS club and all proceeds will go to helping support fi helping support find a cure for blood cancer. Reporting live from the hallway, this is Gabby Palumbo. And now it's time for Bash TV News Sports with Kira. Yesterday, boys wrestling beat Upper Perky Omen 44 to 15. Girls basketball lost to Springford 59 to 24 and boys basketball lost to spring for 65 to 39. That's all I have for sports, back to you. For any freshman who wants to try out for the freshman baseball team, there will be a meeting in room 615 during flex on Wednesday, January 31st. Please contact Coach Hallman with any questions. Are you amazing at playing video games? Do you want to play on a competitive team against other schools in Pennsylvania and matches streams live on Twitch? The Boyertown Esports competition and club teams are having open tryouts. Starting on Monday in room 418, we will be having open tryouts for the following games. Monday, we will be hosting Valorant tryouts from 3 to 5 p.m. after school. Tuesday will be Rocket League tryouts, Wednesday is Overwatch 2, and Thursday are tryouts for League of Legends. All tryouts will be from 3 to 5 p.m. and are hosted by our current team members. Remember, joining esports is like joining a sport. If you are on the team, you are required to attend all practices and matches. Good luck to all participants, and may the odds be forever in your favor. And now, for a new episode of Evan in the Hall. The question is, if you had to get a tattoo, what tattoo would you get? It's a living thing. What's your name? Um, a big burger. Anywhere. It's a big burger. That's my friend. His name's Chum. Hey. If you had to get a tattoo, what tattoo would you get? Um, uh, I would get my my dear, my dear, my one and only Coach Tyler Zellers, and I would get it on my chest. A picture of Hayden Zenko's face. He's right there. <laughs> Where would you put it? On my face. <laughs> You'd have his face on your face? Yeah. If you could get a tattoo, of anything, what would you get? Kermit the Frog drinking tea. He said, um, where did Evan go? I got one, it's a flower. What is it? Um, it has like lavender, baby's breath. We're not sure what this one is, but it's- Baby's beautiful. breath? Yes, baby's breath. What? what? It smells like baby's breath too. It's yeah. good. What no. does baby's breath smell like? Bad. Milk? It smells bad, <laughs> but they're pretty. What is that? He's down there. Are they? <laughs> yeah.
He looks like a ghost. <laughs> I got it. I got it with my sister. I got fire and she got like a water droplet type thing. Why is it a like that? It, it, ha it has a heart. <laughs> it looks like you've never shown that off before. It's new. I would get uh, WWCD, What Would Cooker Do? Oh. Wait, that, where would you get it? Right on my forehead. <laughs> Gravity is unkind. Don't ask me where I would put that. <laughs> if I had to get a tattoo, I would probably get uh, Animal, the Muppet, because I love the Muppets. <sighs> That's it. See you then. <laughs> and now for Batch TV News Flash Weather. Hey guys, uh, so it's good frog weather and I have to remind you all that I have a frog. So, frog, I, yeah, temperature 44 degrees Fahrenheit, humidity is 100% and wind speed is 5 miles per hour. 12 p.m., 50 degrees, warm, nice and humid for a frog. 3 p.m., 59 degrees, basically summer, frogs like the warm. And 6 p.m., 54 degrees, temperature, frogs also like that. Yo. Yo. Today, low 44, high of 59. Back in my day, there's a thing called the sun. Saturday, low 38, high of 54. Wherefore art thou sun? Sunday, low 36, high of 41. Rain, why? And Monday, low 32, high of 41. Here comes the sun. Not come the sun. That's all I got. Back to you guys. From Sarah, Kira, and all of us here at Batch TV News, I'm Kaylee Reinbach. And I'm Lexi Jim Petro. Have, Have a, a great, great day. day.